Hi guys, it's Jacob from StringBuzz here. StringBuzzWorld.org being a music journalism site, links are in the description down below. And we have a brand new song review for you today, and it's the latest by 1OK Rock, and that's American Girls. I'm going to refer to the original articles I usually do for these videos, so I hope you enjoy. So I've been following this group for a little while now, and they've had their ups and downs, with some tracks impressing me much more than others. But on the whole, I'm ecstatic to see an Eastern group do so well in the pop rock scene once again over here in the West. So shall we see what I thought of this brand? new track. Well I actually thought it was okay, it's catchy, it's punchy, it's got a powerful and memorable hook, but it's a little overproduced and a little too radio friendly. Now it's not a bad thing to be radio friendly and you'll pull in many more fans in doing so, but I just felt that this track lacked a little originality and substance to it. I'm all for mindless pop punk tracks, hell I've had my fair share of mindless pop punk groups I've been a part of, but this one is a little on the skimpy side comes to the production of this track, even though it's better than their last few efforts, it still came across as a little too clean for me and a little too overproduced as well. I think this time around we have much better sounding guitars with much better timbres to them, a bass which actually has some tonality to it and a kit that is frenetic and flourishing. But the vocals do sound a bit too clean and gated, becoming a little watery and thin and the stereo field sounds very glossy for a rock track, a little too glossy really. Now I'm hardly expecting sludge metal qualities on the production of this thing but it just felt that the song was too clean for the genre it was trying to go for, especially over here in the West. Musicality wise, the song is quick, is precise and it really doesn't mess around which is a really good thing. Thank god we didn't get as many pointless chorus repeats as we'd usually hear from a pop rock group and it's nice to hear a band who actually ends a track when it should end rather than banging on about the same themes and really dragging it out. This is meant to be a fun, quick, pop punk track and it does that really well, it plays to that strength. The chord progressions are simplistic yet memorable, the drums have enough variation for them for me to really get sucked into their sequences, the bass is finally more present in the mix and the vocals follow a melody that is just plain catchy really. Now sure I don't suggest you go out to this track thinking you're going to hear an absolute rock classic or anything like that, but you'll have fun and it comes pretty naturally too, so basically everything you could want from a just a quick and fun mindless pop punk track. Now don't get me wrong, the lyrics are cheesy, they're corny, but they're no worse to what you're used to hearing in this genre anyway. So all in all, a solid track by a group whose quality does often fluctuate, it's one of the better rock tracks we've had all fortnight, and I have no qualms in saying that, so I think this might be a return to form. So this is a G rating of 6.5 out of 10, which is well above average. If you like this video, then please leave a like, subscribe to see more, and I'll see you around next time. Bye bye